Hey, it's Tom Grosh from Grosh's Lawn Service. We're getting some requests for update on the weather. Right now it's uh, partly sunny out. The wind's right now coming out of the south, southeast. You can see here on the mole chaser there, it's out of the south, southeast. And then we just got back from the grocery store and we went shopping to, to, because of the Armageddon with the snow. And we're going to try to update you here of what's happening. It looks like there's a little price gouging going on because right now they're not selling toilet paper by the packets anymore. They're selling toilet paper by the roll and as you can see here it's two dollars a roll and then the, as you can see on all the rolls they got it marked at two dollars so if you buy more you're just paying for it. you can't they got all the packets broke open of toilet paper and then also on the on the bananas they got everything broken down there's nothing in packets or uh, a bunch of bananas the bananas are down to a dollar 25 a piece per banana and then what they did is i guess they don't have enough bread out so they're making dwarf loaves of bread this is all the bread you get for a dollar there's two crust one on each end two slices of bread in there and it is a dollar this is what they're doing with the bread now see the bread was originally i don't know if you can see that it was originally three dollars for a whole loaf now they got four pieces in it what they did with the milk here is broke the milk down there's not selling gallons of milk anymore they're selling it in containers of milk two dollars for this container of milk this is all the milk you're getting because of the armor again, the stores are running out. You don't even have. And then they got candy canes. They're not selling them in the packets anymore. They got them all broke down there by the piece. They're $1.25 a piece for the candy canes. And then the, in the soup, they run out of Campbell's chicken noodle soup. One of my friends out there, Zach Campbell, he's an heir to the Campbell's soup factory manufacturing business. They don't even have soup in the cans anymore. People are stealing. You just can't make this stuff up. People stealing the soup out of the cans at the market and leaving it behind. I mean, come on, people. It's only a snowstorm. We get them all the time. But this is what's happening right now. You need to get out there and get playing. People, there's not much food left. The snow's coming. You're going to be lucky if you survive this storm. And like I said, Zach Campbell, please support Campbell Soup. My friend Zach Campbell. His stock's way down right now because they're stealing soup and the stores will not replenish it because the people stealing it. I mean, look at this, people. Nothing. They licked the bottom of the can dry. There's nothing in there. So, I got toilet paper for sale right now. $2.75 a roll. I got to make something on it. I mean, this is just not a good business, but I got to make a little money on the toilet paper. And there's only There was only six rolls left at the store. So, I'll get rid of four of them, but I got to save two of them. For myself, I'll sell two of the one of the three bananas. The loaf of bread, I'll give you half of it for 75 cents. I'll keep two pieces for myself. And we only have dwarf loaves of bread, though. Okay, it's only for dwarfs. The milk, if I leave it set out here long enough, it'll be cottage cheese. So if you're interested in cottage cheese, check back in about 75 minutes, and we'll get that taken care of. I just don't know what else to do. We got some corn left in the back of the truck here, it looks like, if you're interested in that. We can make that into, uh, put that in the microwave for you too. So if you're interested in any of these, please contact me as soon as possible at 1-800-FREE-CORN. 1-800-FREE-CORN. Because that's the only thing you're getting today from the grocery market for free is corn. Old field corn. Because everything else is out, people. I can't believe that they broke toilet paper down out of the pack. They broke bananas down off of the bunch. They stole the Campbell soup from my friend Zach. Zach Campbell, how you doing, buddy? There's a shout out to you. Yeah, we're getting ready for the snowstorm. And here we are. We got... Friends, can you believe that loaf of bread was $3 for a whole loaf? And now it's a dollar for the dwarf loaf. i never seen nothing like it in my life. Anyhow, if you need something, we can help you. Give us a call. 301-842-MILK. That's... 301-842-MILK. That spells milk there for some of my slow friends. But if you need milk, we got about... Well, looks like it's... If I get to churn that, we might even get a little bit of butter here this afternoon. Didn't have no butter at the market. They's all sold out of the butter. And somebody actually... They did have one pack of butter left. Man, you can't make this up. Somebody bit off of one of the sticks of butter and put it back in there, man. It was gross. I just couldn't believe it. But anyhow, you don't want to go to the supermarket. It's frenzy. Now they took, you're not going to believe this, they took the wheels off the grocery carts so you couldn't use them, so you can't load them up. So 
It's whatever you get in your hands, people. Don't carry a basket in there. They don't even have nothing else. Cake mixes, cookie mixes, all that stuff, they're out. They're, they are selling flour. They open the bags of flour up down there, and they got them in salt shakers for flour. So, friends, if I can help you, call me 301-842-MILK. It's Tom Grush, Grush Lawn Service. I'm out. Have a wonderful day. Please bring your pets in. Spade and neuter them before the winter storm. Bye.